hello, and I am back, YouTube. Welcome, and I have some exciting news to reveal to you today. I uh, ended up getting my gas tank renewed, as they called it. Uh, there's a website, Gas Tank Renew. Uh, I will link the company in the description. So if you're interested in this process, you can just go there and look up the local shop that does it. Uh, for me, uh, it was an hour and 20 minute drive to have this shop, uh, State Automotive in Midvale, here in Utah, uh, get this done for me. And they did an awesome job. And I just wanna say, I'm excited to finally be done with all the rust and crap that was in my tank. Uh, the filter I put in about a year ago, uh, probably exactly a year ago, it totally clogged the filter, everything. It was just junk. So I ended up going with a new fuel pump, a different brand this time. It's uh, called Kemso. So this this is the fuel hanger. They totally sandblasted it and coated it with their gas, uh, basically, coating. It's like a protective coating that helps protect against rust. Um, there's the uh, Kemso pump. Uh, it does 340 liters per hour. Um, I've already got it put on there. Uh, if you guys are interested in seeing a video on how to do this, I uh, just look look at my past videos. I do a, a fuel pump install back when the tank was pretty crappy. So <clears throat> everything's been coated and redone. Uh, a, a local Supra, other Supra owner, off of uh, Utah Supras on Facebook, he uh, hooked me up with a looks like brand new uh, fuel sender. So I'll actually have a working fuel gauge, which will be amazing. So now this is the tank. Got my flashlight. This is the tank. So they, what they do is they, they cut these openings and then they just fold the whole thing up. Same with this one. They had to cut an opening here, fold it up, and then they take this whole tank and all the components to a sandblaster and they get their sandblaster on the inside, totally sandblast it. And then, I don't know if you guys can see very good, but the inside of the tank has been totally coated and baked. Uh, they put this whole thing in an oven, bake on the coating, and one thing they did have to do is this fuel, uh, basically pan here where the filter or the pump sits. They had to make a new one because the one that's in the super tanks is made of plastic and they said that it wouldn't hold up to the heat of the oven. So they took that one, the plastic one out and they made me a steel, a steel one and they did an awesome job. So yeah, there it is. That is going to go back into the car and then I ended up picking up a triple core radiator uh, for the Supra. Mine's pretty junk so I'm going to replace it with that. It's pretty, pretty massive and I basically went with this because it was cheap. I got it for 150 bucks off Facebook, so not bad. So yeah, guys, I'm going to. Uh, it's going to be a maybe two-part video. I don't know. It's going to be over a course of many days that I put this together. So 
just come along with me on the ride. Thank you. And like and subscribe.